got to find some shelter. What's going on, everybody? My name is Blade. Welcome back to more Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 2. Uh, last episode, uh, we left the house we're in because, uh, man, I forgot the guy's name, but he came to our house and he was looking for them and uh, Clementine and the daughter was the only one there. It was really creepy and I told him about it and we have to move out or move somewhere else. So we've been walking in the woods for five days and they told me to look through the binoculars and see what I see. So um, I see this. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Here, eat this back. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. Where did they let me, a little girl? Across that bridge. Let's go. Like, look through the binoculars. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but... Look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm going to sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. You're not my dad, Carlos. I can do it. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go, too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Ooh, we don't trust him anymore. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's Carver, that's what it is. Days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gang. Family. What do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not going to get in the middle. I would always say family. We've all made mistakes. Done things I that we regret. I want to upset her. a place to talk about someone else's past. I want know? to upset her. I don't want to upset her. Me neither. I'll always say family's the most important thing. I got family tattooed all over me. Ooh. Hmm. Can't shoot him. Too much. Good help. What do you think? Let's two. take him. Let's take him. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Clementine to be a badass. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Yeah. Nice work, kid. Ow. You know, I went back to look at uh, episode one, how young she was. 
She was pretty young. Now she looks like an actual, you know, not teenager, but a lot older, taller, and voice changed a little bit. So it's pretty cool. Machete, man. Freeze there, the game had to load. Uh. Get her! She's not tall enough to hit her head. There we go. No, come on, still be there. Hit him first. Here we go. No! You hold on, you son of a bitch. Thanks, Clem. Clem is a badass. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. Looks like a cool. normal person. You do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. What do I say? You know what? Oh, is he with Carver? I should do the talking. Is he with Carver? It's hard to see. I don't think so. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. I'm Clementine. Wanna help me out here? I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. He looks like a Luke. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything. Not an asshole. You know how it is out here. Not an asshole. <laughs> I'm not an asshole. Well, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? 
I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Do you know Carver? Carver? Like George Washington Carver? The peanut guy? What? He's a man. Never heard of him. But no, I want some peanut butter though. I gotta say, Is that Glenn? you look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Nick, no! Oh my god. What a dumbass. Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. That. You know, because remember, I don't know if you saw, uh, remember episode one. Uh, on the zone. And I don't remember what happened to him or they didn't show anything. So, I, I, for a second I thought that was Glenn. But maybe not. If we just killed Glenn off like that, that would suck. But, um, man, what an idiot. Seemed like a nice guy, too. Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked Shut like. Shut up, Nick. Shut up, Nick. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy gonna shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. Wasn't gonna do anything. Why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I. No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge. We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? I was like, oh, a friendly guy gonna show us dead. Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station mind checking it out maybe we could spend the night here a little small for us though why don't you go look you could use no i'm gonna go sure thanks clem we'll talk this asshole I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on his big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Look, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? A good accent. I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. 
Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. I found it back at the cabin. Let me grab it. What? Really? Yeah, I stole the watch randomly, remember? Thank you. <sighs> this means... Thank you, Clem. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. All right, here's the station. I'm gonna go right in. Oh, yeah. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. The man said he had lots of food. There's got to be something left. Ooh, yeah. Feels pretty good. I guess he slept here. It's dead. Oh wait, can I get in with a knife maybe? Yeah. Go. Oh, two cans. Man, not thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any. He was trying to help to us. Shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever known anyone to do a thing like that? Lots of people. Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. That's funny. She looks just like you. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. She can have it. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Oh, shit. Oh, f fuck balls. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. For. We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nailed down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. 
Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. Mm, I had a treehouse once. Treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Huh. Why'd she hate it? That's a lie. Kept you safe for a little bit in episode one. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good all. grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Oh. Oh, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're you're fine. All right, just just slow down. Just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. <laughs> you're fine, you're fine. I'm like, yes, I know. I'm on the ladder here. Hey, birdie. Made it. Ah! You see anything? I can see the bridge. Oh, there's a flashlight there. Oh, it's at the light for the bridge. Wait, I see something. What is it? Flashlight. Light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. That was fast. Just believe me, you dick. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to... Oh, run? shit. Excuse I didn't me, see man, that. Do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Oh, shit. It's Kenny. Penny. No way. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? I thought I was dead. Yeah, straight up. You know what? I'm going to give him a hug. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. No way. He died. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. Kenny? What? If y'all don't remember uh, season one, episode one, episode... I think it was one of the last episodes, four or five. Kenny died. Looks like he got... He fell and then uh, he kind of took the bait. Um, actually, no. Somebody else fell, and he went to go help them. And zombies came and started taking over the place. And he, like, stayed back. I guess... I guess you didn't really see him die. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. Ooh, look at this place. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? 
Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around. I can speak we're cool. for everybody. Hey, hey, we're cool. We're cool. I can't speak for everyone. Beck, it's their home. We're not going to find another place like this tonight. True. Dad, look. A Christmas tree. Well, no, Sarah. I would have said, yeah, everything's fine. If something would have happened. I don't want that to happen. It's in storage. It's amazing. That would be my weapon of choice. A uh, machete, if I was in an apocalypse. There we go. See, everyone did it anyway. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. This looks relaxing. I hope Kenny's not an asshole. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? You saved me. He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Hell. Lee and I had our differences, that's for sure. But when my son, well, he took care of him, I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's going to be. She said you were dead. Now. Krista told me you were dead. I am. This is all a dream. <laughs> oh my god, that son of a bitch. For some reason I, <laughs> I thought it was the game's gonna cut off and be like, her waking up. Then it turned into a damn cluster. <sighs> Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Shit. Of course he is. Well... Oh, so shit. That's Matthew that was shot. Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Old friends. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. 
Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Shit. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Has been easy. It hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Matthew's the guy we shot. Mm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Looks great. Looks great. It looks like mush. No, it doesn't. Mm -mm -mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. Huh. Striking resemblance. Is everyone saying that? Anyway, I'll take it from here. This is gonna get toasty, guys. All right, guys, that's uh, right there. Good thirty-minute episode for you. Getting pretty interesting, and I'm pretty sure that's Matthew. It was uh, who we shot. Um, that is not. That's not good. That's gonna come up later. Um, and I ran into Kenny. Holy crap, Kenny! I'm so happy. So thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode.